Ramyang Mang is the mantra, the mantra for fire. Ram is fire, Yang is air, Mang is water. So the uh, purification through fire and purification through the uh, the air and purification through the water. So through these three active elements, we purify our karma. So. So imagine, like, uh, if you're, you know, if you're cleaning your clothes, you can do, you know, wash, dry, clean, and put up in the air, so, right? If you think about cleaning your clothes, you it, you can do that, or you can uh, dry, um, yeah. So so the sense of, of course, external element have external ma uh, purifying matters, but internal awareness of those element has power to clear internal karmic conditions, internal uh, uh, wounds. So basically, the visualization and the power of the sound, the power of the blessing of the mantra, has power to clear, purify your karma, the seeds. Seeds of those realms. That makes sense? Yeah, so you might be living in a realm already, but then there, there's a something... Some seeds are still there in you, which is keep on feeding the realm that you're living so that you continuously live in that realm. You don't stop living in that realm. But if the seed get burned, so the fire, ram burned the seed, then there is no, it's like a seed. When you burn the seed, then you put it under the soil. It doesn't give the birth. It's a burned seed, right? So it's, uh, so the idea is to, you're trying to, <coughs> Yeah, so basically trying to destroying some sense of the seed of those realms. So when you say tu, for example, syllable tu, ah, uh, for example, hell, hell, syllable, remember the here, it says ah, tu, yang, sang, sang. Ah is, ah is the sound of awareness, and uh, from that ah, uh, in, in the hell realm, the antidote is love. So space clears anger, allows the love, and purifies the hell realm. Ah, tu, yang, sang, sang, means purify, purify, clear. So, so this mantra may help to burn the seed so that the hell realm will not manifest. Does that make sense? So that, that's the idea. Um, Self transformation, uh, purifying the mantra, purifying through these three active ma mantras of element, and then then the second part is the perfecting with the qualities. So once you purify, like a, once if there is a dirty water in the cup, you clean it, right? You clean it, you dry it, and now it's clean. So what do you do? You just don't leave it empty cup, right? Then you feel it, you feel it with nectar. So we, we say feeling with the milk. It's like milk is a symbol, some sense of symbol of pure. So you clean, and then you put the nectar in. So you clean your body, you clean your speech, clean your mind. Now you perfect. The, your body is clean, you perfect with enlightened body, eternal body. Your speech is clean, you perfect the speech with enlightened speech. Your mind is clean, you perfect your mind with enlightened mind. At least a little bit more enlightened, right? <laughs> Not fully enlightened, a little bit more different, a little, little better. A little better body, a little better speech, a little better mind. That makes sense? So that is A uh, Om Hung, right? So these three syllables, A uh, Om Hung, three syllables representing body, speech, and mind. So with A, uh, uh, you're transmitting uh, the old enlightened quality of the body. You're transmitting all the enlightened quality of the speech. And you're transmitting all the enlightened quality. Mind. So it's like I remember it used to be like a, when you transmit I information from one phone to another phone, you have to kind of bring the two, two, two gadgets closer. Like you have to go like this. So then you, s you said send, receive, Zzz, go. <laughs> right? It used to be more complicated. Nowadays you have an airdrop. 
So it's like a Bluetooth airdrop. So it's a little bit like think you can think about it like that, right? So you you are you have you have deleted all the old files in your body. You deleted all the files in your speech. You deleted all files in your mind. So your file, your body f space in your body is infinite, right? Eternal body. Infinite space. Space in your speech is infinite. Space in your mind is infinite. Now it needs the empowerment. The empowerment is enlightened body, speech, and mind. 